It's all hands on deck if the Giants defense wants to stop Titans running back Derrick Henry on Sunday. And Saquon Barkley is primed for a big year. Former Giants running back Brandon Jacobs is here to break down the battle of the backs. I should have said the battle of the big backs because you're the original big back. I mean, Giants fans remember when you ran over LeBron Landry and Derrick Henry is like the new generational clone of you. So how does the Giants defense stop or slow him down? Well, this is, you know, with me not being in the locker room, you know, with the Giants, knowing their mentality and, you know, like how they think, you know, uh, the defense I played with, that was a part of my team, they're coming up and they're hitting. They come and bring the wood. It doesn't matter who it was running the ball. Like, But right now, you know, I think the Giants have a great opportunity to make a mark. You know, um, you know, first week of the season, they got Derrick Henry. He's coming in. He was a, a 2,000-yard rusher a couple years ago, got hurt last year, still ran the hell out of the football last year as well. So, they, you know, they got to be challenged, and, and they could be the first team uh, in this 2022 season to slow Derrick Henry down or possibly stop him. But I think they got a man now. You know, it's all you know. It's all about your mentality going into it. Well, let's talk about Saquon. He's looked good in this new offense throughout the spring and the preseason, but he's kind of going through something similar to what you went through in the offseason of 2011, working to shut up all that outside sh chatter. So, what advice would you give the two six heading into this season opener? Just focus. You know, uh, one thing about it, and I've seen guys go through this and uh, come through. He got injured two, you know, two years in a row. Um, that's on his mind. Will I make it through healthy? Uh, so he's worried. He's probably worried about in his mind battling with the injury, you know, an injury and coming up for his opportunity where he can make some money. You know, I would tell uh, say Quan Barkley to just go play football. You know, and whatever's going to happen is, is going to happen. You know, uh, I think he's, I, I think he's had plenty of success. He looks great. Uh, this season, I had a chance to sit down and talk with him. Um, it was during camp. And, you know, I asked him, you know, Park, so what did you do differently this offseason than you, you know, have done in the past? He said, well, I didn't train as much. I didn't do as much, you know, as I, you know, as I previously was doing. I'm like, you know what? I said that right after you went down the second time. I said, I don't think Barkley giving his body enough time to rest. You know, and, and to hear him say that, I'm like, you know, that's exactly what I thought. Like, I train nowhere near as hard as these guys are training right now. And I'm being honest. Like, to us, you go run some gassers, you know, you go run 10, you know, gassers, lift weights, and you're done for the day. Like, these guys are doing all kinds of different things, you know, and as it helps them out, it's really hard on them as well. You know, and I watch guys, you know, like guys running up hills and like Derrick Henry runs up hills with a weight vest on, pulling somebody. I'm like, man, I didn't do that type of stuff. I'm being honest, you know. So he said he did a, a little less training um, this season than he's done in the past. So hoping that that can be, you know, a difference. But he got to go out and play and, and not worry about it. And I think he'll have a good season. You know, my concerns is that he can't stay with the Giants. Big bro, you still looking good. You sure you want to suit up on Sunday? No, uh, you know, be London, you know, I, I went through something where I was going to try that. And training every day, trying to get ready to do that. That is not the move for a guy <laughs> like myself. Kind of fall back and, and assume your place in life. Because <laughs> that's not it. Hey, less is more. Less is more. But I appreciate you, know you joining us today.